Hi, good, good evening, good afternoon and good welcome. Welcome to my next podcast, um, Michelle Marks Vintage Knitwear or Mark Knitwear, whichever you'd like to call me. Anyway, this is my third video and I want to talk about one of my favourite patterns which is very versatile for the winter. And you can use, actually you can use two types of yarn, you can use double knit or you can use arum weight. Um, this sample here is using double knit and this one, which is my newly created one, is using arum weight. Um, now if you use arum weight, it's, it's warmer, it's a lot thicker and it comes out just slightly bigger than the actual original one. But I want to show you, this is the original pattern, it's a Ben's wear. It's a 1950s pattern and it's really, really cute and it has a matching hat. So this is the hat, which is the double knit. Um, very cute hat, it can be a bit floppy, um, like that, very cute. And actually, if you've ever seen the film Genevieve, um, the actress in that, I can't remember her name, but she wears a set in that which is very similar to this one. Anyway, I'd like to show you the hat that I knitted, which is slightly bigger than the one in the double knit, and this is the arm one. So, very cute. I wore it today. Uh, it's quite chilly today, so it went down a treat when I was out shopping. But it's very cute, very simple. In fact, um, you can wear it either way, but obviously I chose to use, which would normally be the inside out of the actual pattern, but I think it looks quite nice in the reverse and it just made it a bit more textured to go with this. Anyway, so as you all know, I love tweed. Tweed is my thing. So as you can see, this is a tweed version which is pure wool, Scottish wool. And because I had 500 grams, which wasn't going to be enough to knit in one colour, I decided to buy some 200 grams of double knit, not double knit, Aram, um, which is just a plain bog standard 100% acrylic. But if you mix acrylic with pure wool, it just gives you a bit more flexibility and it just goes perfect together because sometimes people don't want to wear 100% wool especially because it really does keep you warm and I, to believe me, we've got the central heating on and I am roasting. Anyhow, I thought I'd do this video while I was wearing this jumper and then I don't have to wear it again. Anyway, I just want to let you know that this is mine, I'm keeping this one. Um, as you can see, it's got a very deep waistline which is really perfect and obviously the cuffs are kind of contrast too but it really is a very warm jumper. Anyway, I'm going to be knitting one of these to sell. Um, that's the next thing that's going to be on my needles and I bought this beautiful pink tweed which came today. Um, I buy it off eBay, very reasonably priced and I'm going to be buying maybe a dark grey in 100% in acrylic which will go really nice as a contrast in this design with this wool. So that's what's next on my needles. Also, if you have enough wool left over, I recommend trying to knit another hat. So the next on my project list is this beret. Uh, so hopefully I'm going to have enough wool to finish it off. Uh, I'm kind of not sure at the moment, so I'll update you on my next post as to whether I did have enough wool to knit with it. Anyway, so that's it. That's next project that I'm currently working on and hopefully it will be finished soon and I can share with you. Anyway, with all that, I think that's enough for today. So I hope you enjoyed this little video and I'll see you again soon.